All right, this is the meat. Just finished it. Looks sort of like this. Oh, <laughs> duh. Anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah. So that's done. Um, what I did is I put about like a fourth of cumin, a fourth of a cup of cumin, and like an eighth of cayenne. Exactly, I'm telling you everything exactly. I put like salt and pepper to taste, of course. And I put only like a, like a fourth of uh, raisins too, a fourth of a cup of raisins too, and a fourth of a cup of the Crisco. So you could also put however, like more or less, whatever you want to do. But that's what I usually use. Alright, so now let's get out the onions. The onions should be cool by now. Alright, nice and crystally. And you mix it in with the meat. Now I'm going to show you how to put the empanada itself together. Okay. I also here. I cut the eggs, hard-boiled eggs, in four into into fourths. Okay. I'll show you step by step. Put the flour down, the dough. You put like about a this amount of meat, one big spoonful of meat. Down right in the middle. Okay. And with that, put it in one of these. Right there. And an olive. Okay, to seal it, you use a paintbrush or you can use your finger right around the edges. Seals it up, stays closed while you cook them. All you do is just fold it, pinch the edges. Like that. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to use a fork to close it up a little bit more. That's about ready to go in the oven. Just I like to um, put the oil down in the pan first. Okay. So it's gonna stick. Put some uh, coat it with the egg because it gives it a nice brown color when it comes out of the oven, nice and crispy. All over. Okay. Even the back if you want, but mainly just the front. Put it down, and that should be ready to go in the oven. I like to make about a couple more of these, at least 10, 20. So that's what I'm gonna be making. We put it in the oven. I preheat the oven, and I leave it in there for about half an hour, and until or until they're like, you know, crispy and brown. So yeah, I'll show you how they turn out. Okay. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost finished now. We got a couple of empanadas that I showed you how to put them together. And we're gonna put them in the oven. I preheated it to 425. So when it's done preheating, just put it in there, in the middle shelf. Okay. And then leave it in there for 20 to 30 minutes, and or at least until golden brown. And it should come out, you know, perfect. Done. I uh, just took them out the oven, they look nice and crispy, and um, yeah, I want to thank my grandma because she showed me how to make these from, uh, she was from Chile, and this is her main recipe for making empanadas, so, and she passed it down to me, I, just, I, I make them now, so, and I love them, they taste awesome, 
And uh, also, I want to thank my aunt Linda for filming. She's she's awesome too. And then, uh, all right, so I'm gonna take one out and see what they look like on the inside. Here, first, yeah, look at it, how crispy. It looks awesome. I just, I think they turned out great. All right. Put some hot sauce on that, like use Tabasco sauce, and it's awesome. So yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching, everybody. And uh, yeah, hopefully you'll make these all the time, just like I do. All right.